Okay, yeah, they're not paying any attention to each other. <laughs> Anyways, hey guys, buddy kid again. Welcome back to more Scabbard Sword HD. Last time, we were instructed by Captain to go get his book from his uh, hind quarters in this episode. I figured out last week that he had to use the beetle. I just used it. Let's go ahead and get the start. Alright, now hopefully there's no other beetles for me to get, because I'm actually, like, half health right now trying to get back here, and uh, I, I don't feel like dying. Uh, okay. I can I actually get back from here and not get burnt to the first? Oh. Ow. Actually, you know what those firebirds attacks kind of remind me of? It kind of reminds me of that, uh, wiz of the wiz ropes from, uh, what is it? Uh, from, uh, Wind Waker. They do that same attack with the fire and their bird-like creatures. Oh, uh, well, Toucans and all. Attacking Toucans. Which he also played this game. I don't know if he finished it, but I remember he actually did a Let's Play this game too, so... Alright, well, now that we're in the cabin, I'm gonna get this. Dust this place off. Get these, um, get these little scorpion babies out of here. I don't know why they're still here. Because I could pretty much kill their mama. Oh! They're probably just like surviving off of like eating dust or something. Oh! We got the ancient sea chart. This old map details the areas as if it was long ago before the sea succumbed to the desert sand. Master, look over there! Oh, That's kind of cute actually. The <laughs> scorpion in the cutscene. That is the ship connecting Naru's flame. There's a 90% chance that the synthetic life forms assembled here are the crew. This is image would indicate that the ship's captain spent many happy days among his crappy crew members. Okay. Now before I leave, I'm gonna make sure that there's actually nothing else for to do here. Ah, ah, see? You never know. Also, I just blew it. There's any other those uh, crystal things in here. So, uh, let's just get rid of these things. They're, they're nuisances. Now, what's in here? You really shouldn't open other people's cupboards without permission. <laughs> oh man, those people are long gone. Not that I'm sure they won't mind. They won't mind at all. <laughs> oh, in case you guys are wondering, no, I am not drunk or high or whatever. Um, I'm actually very loopy and sleep deprived because I've been waking up on a couch for two days straight. With all of that out of the way, let's go ahead and grab this and <laughs> ride our way back down to where we were. And now we're gonna go to the captain, show him the map, and now he can then he can guide us the way. We make a little shortcut down there too. Save some time. And I'm not gonna lie, it would have been really cool to see Link do a flip off that thing, but you know. <laughs> I guess Nintendo wasn't that cool. They were cool back in the day when like Link in Wind Waker would fly out of a um, a pot and he would do like a flip while doing so. But nah. You got the same chart room? Now we can finally navigate properly, Zert. Weep, let's go look for my ship. Shall we set sail? Set sail! Anchors away, Zerm! Alright. Open up the sea chart you brought with you, Zert. Ah, now it actually looks like an ocean. The shipyard at its this location, Vert. Let me mark it for you with an X, Fweep. So we gotta go this way, and then that way. And then I'll take this off, put it right here. And then I'll put you right there to guide you, and I don't need that. The shipyard is where we used to build our ships, Vert. My ship was built there too, Weep. If you go to the shipyard, you might find some clues at the location of me ship, Zert. Okay, set sail, Verm. Let's see if I remember exactly how to do this. It was... No, that's not it. Oh, yeah, we got- No, 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 wait, wait, that's right. We gotta, like, hold the B button down and, like, guide it that way. Oh, that's gonna suck. Oh, wait, we just gotta, like, push forward. That's right. I remember. <laughs> it's been about a week since I sailed on this boat, but, you know. Okay, 
looks like the uh, crystal is gonna be guiding our path. There's water right below us. Man. It is really cool that they're adding like both Twilight Princess elements and Wind Waker elements in one chapter. Yeah, see, they even got the TNT barrels that would stop it. Like, it combines Twilight Princess elements with the claw shot, but it also combines Wind Waker elements with the, um, hey, froggers, uh, with the, uh, the sailing mechanic. And there's even enemies out on the ocean, too. Now, my guess is they just shoot, like, water at us, and if we run over them, they die, but I'm not too concerned about that. What I am concerned about, though, is just following this pillar of light and making our way forward. Alright, I'm just gonna ignore you guys out of my desire to get the ship. Alright, now this is where we disappear, right? Get out. And here we are, the shipyard. Oh, that's right, that's right! This is where Tyler did that uh, collab with Trigger Conroy! Now I remember! <laughs> It also may or may not be in my favorites playlist because it combines both my inspirations for Let's Play. <laughs> oh, man. We've arrived, firm! This is the island where we used to make our ships, Zert. You'll find the shipyard here as well as the town where the workers lived, weep. That building is the construction bay, firm. Ah, but the entrance is closed, Verma. Looks like you can't get in. Each location on the island is linked to the others via a minecart track, Verma. You might be able to get to the back door of the construction bay if you can get around to the other side of it using a minecart, Verma. Minecart? Oh, Super Paper Mario elements from the crack chapter. There's a minecart station over there, Zert. You should head to the station first. I'll wait here for a week. Now, I won't lie to you guys. Back when I was like really little, I would give all the little robots like a really babyish voice. But I figured since that guy was a pirate, I'll give him like a really deep kind of uh, piratey kind of like voice. I don't know. I think weird things. Ooh. Vicious like enemies. Perhaps hopefully they'll uh oh, oh, oh. Right, uh we might be able to get rid of them. I got rid of one. Oh oh you breathe fire. Okay. Oh yep, he can fist knock this guy. He did the Alright, well, you're gone now. Okay, and now we climb our way back up. And he said this was the minecart area, right? Right over here? Okay, hello, sir. Oh. This station here was used by folks heading into the old mines. People still ride the minecarts all over the place, though. I'm probably supposed to tell you there's a, some safety information about using the carts posted on the wall over there. Cart riding can be... Uh, dangerous at times, so I would suggest you give that a quick read. Alright, let's go ahead and read this then. I can't read it. Oh, maybe it'll tell me. Alright, uh. Sh -sh 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 -sh. Lean your body in the way so you want to go. Get in. Oh, that's right. I remember this now. Now, my guess is that whenever we turn, we have to lean the cart so it doesn't fall off. That's right, I remember this. <laughs> yeah, that's right, I remember this. Oh, oh, don't fall now, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Don't fall. Wee! <laughs> now we just gotta like, ooh, don't you dare, don't you dare. Alright, here we go. Here we go, momentum, momentum, momentum. Ooh, ooh. Oh, here we go, here we go. Oh, oh, oh that's scary, oh! Area. Sweet ground. <gasps> More dragonflies. No, 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 it's okay. You, you guys are 
about your business, don't mind me. Oh, not Kill it before it lays eggs. Alright, which way do we go? I'm guessing this way to another minecart. It does kind of remind me of the super paper element, though, but only a little more involved. You gotta like eat to not die. Wee, wee. All right. Oh, oh careful, careful. Now. I, mean, I guess as we want to lean in the direction we want to go in, that's right. That's right. But yeah, let's not go to the way of the X. That'd be great. Okay. Oh, oh, Jesus. Yard construction bay. That didn't take us very long at all. Not bad. Alright, some little scorpion dude there. With the passing of many years, this structure has filled with sand. I recommend looking in the looking in the sand for a clue that might detect the location of the ship. So it looks like we're gonna be getting out the uh gust bellows. I mean we gotta like jump down here and Oh, 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 that's bad. Oh, that's super bad. Ooh, hello, hello. <laughs> fighting this thing again. <laughs> oh, 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 this is, yeah, dude, that's right, this one. Oh, 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 Alright, well that's where it's dead. 
Just a bunch of hearts this time, though. Master, it would appear that the many years this factory went unused, monsters have moved in and built a nest. I now estimate that your chance of finding a clue in the sand here, as the ship's location is extremely low. <laughs> you think? Oh, well. Uh, next time on Skyward Sword HD, we're gonna go through that door and see where it leads us. See you guys later. Eat bananas.